So my name is Michael Taylor, and mural and Philip Berman Curator of Modern Art here at the Philadelphia Museum of Art. And I'm the curator of the Picasso and the Avant-Garde in Paris exhibition, which features nearly 200 works of art, many of which haven't been seen in several decades. It's going to include very wonderful collages, papier collé, very fragile works of art by Picasso and Braque that really get out because they are light sensitive and inherently fragile, but they're really going to make the viewing experience something very special. This painting here, a 1906 self-portrait by Picasso, is the first work you'll see in the exhibition and a wonderful way to kick off the presentation because here's Picasso newly arrived in Paris about to take on the art world and rethink the history of painting. And he's dressed like a boxer and what you'll notice about the painting is there's no paintbrush. He's such a magician, he doesn't need that mediating paintbrush in which to change the way we think about the world and reality. I think it's a great way to start the show and it will be followed by 10 galleries devoted to what happened to Picasso and his avant-garde colleagues. And I'm thinking here of Georges Braque, Juan Gris, Fernand Léger, Constantine Brancusi, all the great modern masters who were in Paris in the early decades of the 20th century. Any curator of modern art, such as myself, dreams of doing one day a Picasso exhibition. And I've certainly been thinking about how to display our Picasso collection in new ways for many years. And I think what's exciting about this exhibition is it gives me a chance to think about how our collection was formed, how it came together, what are its strengths? And I think that's something that the public will really respond to, seeing these works in a new way, but also many, many works that have never been on view, at least in the permanent collection galleries. So there'll be something fresh and new for everyone to see and a very exciting narrative.